Hey guys, welcome back. It's Petite Ju, and if you're new here, welcome, welcome. On this channel, we are focused on fitness, travel, and lifestyle. I know you like travel. Okay, girl, there's no video. But <laughs> we're definitely working on travel, so it's coming up. But for today, we're going to be focusing on lifestyle. I have an unboxing video, okay? <laughs> this is something new for me. As you know, um, I've only done fitness. So it's definitely something I'm kind of like looking forward to doing for you guys. Um, so if you have not yet, hit that subscribe button. We can be family, okay? And also while you're at it, you might as well hit that notification bell so that you see all of my videos when they do go up. And without further ado, let's get into this video. Okay guys, so we are going to be unboxing the new Givenchy GQ sandals. And this is what it's looking like. All right. So I'm gonna get a bit closer. Okay. So it came in this really sweet white box and the sandals actually retail for $925 um, but I didn't pay that because I was waiting okay so um, let me read the details on the sandals really quickly so it is the GQ sandals um, the sandals come in um, the sandal is in smooth napa lambskin leather it has a G chain line a thin strap with metal G buckle around the ankle um, the sandal heel height is 4.1 inches so yes yeah, so those are the details on the website for the sandals um, I was able to get the sandal for $765, $765 before taxes and that's because I waited for Nevis to go on sale um, so I think I got it for like either 10 or 15 percent off I'm not too too sure listen I'm not good at math so whatever but um, I know I ended up paying $765 um, before taxes so yeah those are detail um, as far as the color um, I did get this sandal in beige and the reason I'm doing this video is because I know for a fact when I looked up this particular sandals in beige on YouTube um, I did not find a video especially um, I was looking to see what it was gonna look like on a chocolate girl you know just to make sure if it was gonna be more beige or nude or I'm not sure maybe like a pink um, I mean I seen what it looked like on a model um, I just wanted to make sure um, it was going to translate um, to my color so this is what the sandals Okay, so it's this box. And you have this little um, pouch, which is pretty much have the G sign on there. Um, I don't know if you can see because it's black, but yeah, so this is what it's in. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all, I had it the other way. So yeah, this is it. The little um, Givenchy um, sign on there. Let's take out the sandals and see what it's given. And this is the sandals, y'all. Isn't it pretty? Okay. So let's get closer. Okay. Might have to kneel. But yeah, so this is what she's looking like. And I'm going to try them on so you guys are going to see it. Um, so yeah. Okay, y'all. So this is what the sandals looks like. Okay. So I'm going to stand up and show you guys what it's given. This is the back. I really do love this heel. Um, this sandal is super duper comfortable. Um, it's definitely a classic piece to have. I feel like it's something you can um, definitely dress up and down as I mentioned before. Um, so yeah. Um, I do want to talk about one of the cons um, with the sandals and it's definitely not something that affects me but I know for other girls it might be a problem. The sandals uh, come with three little holes um, which is not the norm because most sandals do have like five holes so you have um, a little bit more um, of an option. Um, so I don't know if you're a girl with a bigger ankle this might be um, 
or inconvenience for you but it's definitely something that's fixable because if you really do want to get the sandals and you have a bigger ankle um you can definitely take it to a shoemaker and all they have to do is maybe put in a few more holes whatever um that's convenient for you um but yeah that's about it um i don't think i have any other concerns um again this sandals is true to size i do wear a us size six and that's going to be a 36 in european sizes again this is too much so you know it's going to be european sizes so if you are a girl that wears size six in the u.s um 36 is going to be good for you especially if you do have a slender feet my feet is pretty um average size so i don't wear a wide but w um so yeah so if you want i'm definitely um give this a shot i do love this sandal and definitely something um that i didn't really well it's definitely on the website maybe i kind of overlooked it but it do have leather insoles so it feels pretty like cushiony i mean it feels really really soft in there i feel like a bunch of other um shoemakers should adapt this because baby i don't want to be walking on hardwood floors this is definitely different you feel like you're walking on something more like a um i don't know like well like a foam or something really really soft so that's definitely a plus um what else yeah i mean i don't know i don't think i have any other concerns um again it's a classic piece of sandals it's something that's not gonna go out of style so um i mean if you can afford it um as far as a price i think it's definitely a great buy and yeah that's about it so if you have not yet um definitely hit that subscribe button and if you like these type of videos definitely like it because you know that's how um the algorithm works so um besides that i don't want to keep talking um i hope you guys do find this video helpful if you have any questions definitely let me know in the comments section and until next time peace out